Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening! Welcome back, folks! <laughs> oh, shit! Today is going to be a special video. Um, actually, there's nothing really special about it. Uh, <laughs> I'm just so happy, man. I'm just so happy. Yeah, today's going to be like a channel update. I'm going to give you guys the lowdown on what's going on in my life currently, what has happened, and what I'm going to be expecting to happen in 2017. Got big things, big plans, just huge, just huge things going on in my life. And I've got so much to talk about, and I really want to, you know, get you guys up to speed, let you guys know what's going on with J-Pod. You know, I see him doing this, I see him doing that, but I'm going to let you guys know what really is happening. First and foremost, there's going to be a little J-Pod running around. <laughs> yes, it is official. My wife and I, we are expecting to have a child here on August 25th. That is the current due date. And I, I want to I talk about this for a little while. Because I, I just, again, first and foremost, I, I already know I already said that once. And today's going to be a huge ramble video. Maybe 10 minutes, maybe 15 minutes. I don't know. We'll just see how the video goes. So... Uh, like I usually say, crack open your favorite beverage, kick your feet up. Uh, it's just going to be some Horizon Zero Dawn gameplay. So enjoy the B-roll. I'm just going to bring some Encounter uh, Machine gameplay to you guys. Um, before we get on the baby news, Horizon Zero Dawn. Absolutely incredible. Absolutely amazing. Uh, I might even share some impressions of this game uh, to the to the end of the video. Uh, not really like a review, more like a casual review. Maybe just just impressions. But yeah, today's going to be a ramble video, channel channel update, whatever you guys want to call it. I just want to get you guys the lowdown on what's going on in my life, what I'm expecting to be happening. So yes, like I said, it's official. Everybody, put your hands together. <laughs> J-Pot's going to have a baby, a baby, a baby. You know, and and I'm I'm really just feeling blessed right now. Just absolutely feeling blessed. I, I want to go ahead and tell you guys the story. This was no easy task, okay? Yes, my wife and I have been trying to have a baby. I know a lot of people out there, you know, you know, oops, I'm pregnant. Uh-oh. You know what I mean? That's not the case with me. My wife and I got married uh, three, almost four years ago this October, and we are high school sweethearts. I know that sounds cheesy, you know. <laughs> pardon the pardon the cheese on the side, guys. But yes, we are high school sweethearts. We've been together for 16 years. And we bought a house together about seven or eight years ago. And I finally put a ring on it about four years ago. Bless her heart for waiting so long. She was so mad at me for the longest time, how long I made her wait to put a ring on it. So fellows out there that you guys have been with the same lady for five, six years, put a ring on it, man. She's going to leave your ass if you don't. But um, yeah, we're having a baby. And this is really, really special to me, uh, to special to us, special to both of our families. You have no idea how many, and I'm, I'm kind of, uh, the hairs are standing on my neck right now. It's just absolutely blessed we have been trying for you know let's just say that we've been trying for a while and my heart goes out to the ones out there that have been trying for years okay i know people that have been trying for years and there's it just can't you know what i mean and and it's it's amazing how scientific getting pregnant is you know it just blew my mind you know, you see all these kids, you know what I mean? They're so f young and fertile, you know what I mean? It's just like, wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, you know what I mean? It's just like shit. But then you got people out there that have, have, that try on, on a specific schedule all the way down to the minute, you know what I mean? Ovulation. It is just blew my mind how much I learned. Um, I'm currently here. I'll show you right here. Here's my book. Uh, the Expectant Father, Facts, Tips, and Advice for Dads-to-Be. This is the second edition by Armin A. Brott and his wife, Jennifer Ash. So, very, very cool. I've been, um, I'm trying to see my wife is currently four months pregnant. So, yeah, there's another. We're past the first trimester, which is very, very important. Once you get to the second trimester, you're pretty much smooth sailing. But, uh, yeah, 
J Pot's reading a book. I know, right? <laughs> so very, very cool. I'm learning so much in that book. Uh, like I said, my wife is 16 weeks, roughly four four months pregnant, and we're a little under the the uh, halfway mark. And uh, yeah, absolutely blessed, absolutely blessed. And I'm I'm gonna go ahead and thank the angel that I spoke to on the beach of Sanibel Island last June, a year ago. I was on the beach, and it was probably 11.30 at night, midnight, and there's a beautiful storm. I'm out on the ocean all by myself, uh, half drunk, of course. And, uh, I mean, let's be honest here, right? It's, it's vacation. So I'm on the beach by myself, you know, there in a soul for miles, and I had a little conversation with an angel, and um, that angel actually uh, uh, manifested himself in the form of a passerby. And I, I want to just quickly tell you about my angel story. And, and mind you... Mind you, I'm not religious. I have never uh, uh, been religious. I've never forced religion on anybody. I do not even go to church, okay? So I don't have a religious bone in my body. But I do believe in angels. I believe in somebody. You know, I believe in somebody watching over me. And uh, But the point is, I had a conversation with the sky, some weird drunk guy talking to the sky, and all of a sudden this angel walked right up to me put his hand on my shoulder, and said that I am truly blessed. And that was it. Scared the hell out of me. Absolutely scared the living hell out of me. And uh, I told a few people that story, and they all told me I was just crazy. And, um, you know, so if there's any relig religious folks out there, you believe in God, um, yeah, no shit, right? An angel actually talked to me. And what I was asking to that sky, this is the cool part, the conversation that I was having with that, that sky littered in thunderstorms and lightning bolts and just this beautiful midnight sky over the Sanibel Island, Florida. And uh, what the conversation I was has asking, uh, uh, was having, uh, I was pretty much asking to be blessed. This is the weird part. I was asking to be blessed. I said, you know, my wife and I, we've been trying to have a child and, you know, just doesn't seem like things are going our way, you know, everything's against us, and and um, that angel, like I said, touched me on the shoulder, said, you are blessed, and then I mean disappeared into the night. I'm telling you, scared the hell out of me. So, here it is, we found out on Christmas Eve, I shit you not, on Christmas Eve, my wife called me, and didn't tell me, just told me to keep my phone handy, and she was waiting on the phone call from the, the hospital to give her the confirmation. And let me tell you, brothers, sisters out there, what a special day. And what a day to receive that special news on was Christmas Eve of 2016. So here it is, four months later, my wife is officially four months pregnant. And uh, there's going to be a little J-pot running around this August. It's going to be amazing. It's absolutely going to be amazing. Like, I'm, I mean, pardon the cheese again, you know what I mean? But I'm getting a little uh, getting a little worked up, so I apologize about that. You guys don't want to hear any more about that. Let's go ahead and move on. Uh, little J-Pot coming in this August. Awesome. Round of applause. Thank you so much. I mean, to all of you guys, thank you. Awesome. Um, but, yeah, let's go ahead and move on. Uh, some other things that's going on in my life. Uh, I think I'm going to step up the production here on the channel. Uh, if you haven't noticed, I've been uploading more over to uh, my sponsor, not sponsor, or partner, uh, uh, Pixel Enemy. I'm a Pixel Enemy producer. They have roughly 300,000 subscribers. And, uh, it, you know, it used to be a mainly a Battlefield channel. So Max started a second Battlefield channel called Battle uh, uh, Pixel Enemy Revive, which is primarily Battlefield. And Pixel Enemy is just kind of, you know, random. Anything and everything, trailers, commentaries, battlefield, montages, etc., etc. So I've been uploading more, um, more and more over on Pixel Enemy. And I just wanted to say huge shout out to Mac Ashworth. You have been absolutely tremendous in my motivation. And I greatly appreciate that, brother. I really, I, I greatly appreciate it. So Mac, I seriously doubt you're watching, but if you are... I appreciate all the support that you've been giving me over on Pixel Enemy, and you, you've just been representing very well, and I, I thank you for that, brother. Um, yeah, so that's 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 kind of some big news, is I'm going to be uploading more. I don't really know what I'm going to be uploading more of, you know, impressions, reviews. I'm going to start uploading more trailers, uh, you know, just 
comprehensible videos, more commentaries. That's what I should say. More, I'm gonna be uploading more commentaries. But yeah, let's go ahead and wrap up this ramble video. Um, guys, I mean, just my life is 100 miles an hour right now. And I'm going to be uploading more. My wife's going to be have a, uh, having a, a baby. We're going to be having a baby. Uh, and, and, you know, I'm not going to tell you guys if it's a boy or girl. I'll, I'll let you know in August. But, uh... <laughs> oh, Jesus, has it been 10 minutes already? God dang it. Yes, we have. it has. All right, we need to wrap up the video. I talked way too long. I don't want to take up any more of your guys' time. So, with that said... If you enjoyed today's video, please hit the indicator of the upward thumb. I would greatly appreciate it. I really would. It's very, very near and dear to my cheesy little heart. Awesome. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, fellas and ladies and, and girls and boys and moms and dads and, and all that good stuff. Peace out.